when he hears that fire alarm Sam is always cool and calm If you're stuck, give him a shout He'll be there to help you out So move aside, make way For Fireman Sam, cause he's gonna save the day Fireman Sam, cause he's way to the core Yet? Not yet, Norman. He's still got one last customer to serve. <laughs> Hello, Trevor. Hello, Dillis. I bet you can't wait to get stuck into my barbecued sausages. Yeah, I love sausages. Good eye. I hear there's going to be a barbie lighter. There certainly is, Tom. And Trevor is going to be cooking his famous barbecued sausages. Ah, uh, sausages are good, mate, but I prefer my barbecue king prawns. <laughs> King prawns aren't proper barbecue food. Not like sausages. Well, they must be quite nice. They're called king prawns. Hey, I got a bunger idea. I'll get some king prawns from the Whole Fish Cafe, then I can show you how good they really are. Yes, and we can taste them and see which is the best. Trevor's sausages are Tom's king prawns. What? And the winner will be the barbecue champion of Punty Pandy. Great. See you there. <clears throat> well, I'm not worried. I'm sure my sausages will make me the barbecue champion. Won't they? OK, everyone, there's going to be a barbecue in Ponty Pandy today. And Trevor will be cooking his delicious barbecue sausages. <laughs> So we're going to be going through some basic barbecue safety. What is that noise? I don't know, sir. Actually, I think it's coming from there. I'm sorry, but all this talk about barbecues and sausages is giving me a rumbly tummy. Try and concentrate, Cridlington, and stop thinking about how delicious Trevor's sizzling beauties Ooh, are going to taste. Sorry, sir. Are the sausages ready yet, Trevor? Oh, not yet, Norman. You're a bit early. I haven't even lit the charcoal yet. He's very hungry, you know. Hi, everyone. Oh, Trevor, I see you've got an old-fashioned barbie. I always use a gas one myself. <gasps> wow! It looks like a spaceship! I'm sure it looks very nice, but you'll never be barbecue champion cooking on gas. It just doesn't taste the same as food cooked on real charcoal. That's true. It tastes even better. <laughs> now, never barbecue indoors. Where else shouldn't you barbecue, Penny? Too close to a fence or building, sir. You could set them on fire. Correct! You don't want to set fire to your scrummy, flavour-filled sausages. Sorry, sir, but you keep talking about the sausages. Well, uh, where else shouldn't you barbecue, Sam? Not under a tree, sir. You could set fire to that. Oh, correct. Oh, look at that. You can't beat a real fire, can you? Ooh. Mom! <coughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. Come over here, Dillis. You won't have any problems like that with my barbie. Watch this. Woohoo! There you go, smoke free and all ready to cook on. No, that's much better. Oh, don't worry, the smoke will be gone soon. Ooh, those king prawns look lovely. I can't wait to try one. Don't worry, mate, they'll be ready in no time. Mm, what's that smell? Sausages. See, you can't beat the smell of sausages cooking on a proper barbecue. Oh, Trevor. Maybe you are the barbecue champion of Ponty Pandy. Who wants to try my king prawns? They're cooked and ready to eat. Oh, that was quick, Tom. Oh, oh yes. Very tasty. Sausage time! Wow! This is a gas canister. Some barbecues use gas instead of charcoal to cook lovely, scrumptious sausages on. 
Don't you have to keep canisters away from the fire, sir? That's right, Sam. If they get too hot, they can explode. Is it nearly time to go to the barbecue yet? Well, who's the barbecue champion of Ponty Pandy? Oh, it's so difficult to decide. I'm still hungry. Maybe I should eat a bit more. Then I'd really know which one tasted best. And we'd like some too. We're starving. Oh, no worries, Bronwyn. I can cook you up some king prawns faster than Trevor can cook his sausages. We'll see about that. Just turn up the gas and I can cook even faster. Wow! That's very Ooh. clever. It's not that clever. All I have to do is put on some more charcoal and I can cook faster too. No problem for me. I just turn up my gas to the max. I'll just put all the charcoal on in one go. Then I'll really be cooking. I'll show you who's the barbecue champion of Ponty Pandy. Uh, mate, I think you might have overdone it. Huh? Oh! Oh, no! Stop, Dr. Norman! Oh, we'd better call Fireman Sam. Oh, Tre Trevor Evans Barbecue has set fire to a tree. There's a barbecue blaze at the picnic area. I hope you're all paying attention in this morning's lesson. Well, Elvis, it looks like you'll be eating those sausages sooner than you thought. I just hope there's some left. I think we're going to need two hoses for this one, Penny. OK, Sam. OK, Elvis, turn on the water. <laughs> Sam, look, there's one of those gas canisters. It might explode. Well spotted, Elvis. Keep everyone at a safe distance while we get the blaze under control. Right you are, Sam. Everyone, back, please. Penny, keep spraying the gas canister to keep it cool while I put out the rest of the fire. Don't worry, Sam. I'm on it. There. All out. Uh, can we go and see if there are any sausages and king prawns left, Fireman Sam? Sorry, Norman. Gas canisters can stay hot for a very long time. It won't be safe to go over there for quite a while yet. Oh, I'll just have to take the rest of my sausages home. And I'll have to take more king prawns. But I'm so hungry. I never even got a sniff of those sausages or the prawns. Maybe next time you should set your barbecue away from the trees. And maybe a little less charcoal? Well, you're right there, Sam. Oh, it was my fault too, Trevor. I was showing off a bit. Now no one can have my sausages. Or my king prawns. Wait a minute. That oil drum has given me an idea. There you go. One barbecue. Perfect for sausages and king prawns. But this time, you'll have to cook together. No worries. Thanks, Fireman Sam. i got to give it to you, mate. Those sausages do smell good. Well, so do your king prawns. Maybe we can both be the barbecue champions of Ponty Pandy. <laughs> Bonds are idea, mate. Ooh, are the sausages nearly ready? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he does go <laughs> on. <laughs> Save the day, Fireman Sam, cause he's brave to the core. 